Hey guys, it's taking me a long time, but but I've got it, and well, you want to see it? Well, you you got it. Jurassic World, ha ha! I've got the game, and I just got, and I just made myself a theme park on Isla Nublar, and Isla Nublar on on this game, Jurassic World Evolution is the sandbox island. Like any sandbox, I can make it anything I want. And if you look down on your, well, on your right, depend, depending on where you're looking at it, my count, my amount is unlimited. Ha <laughs> ha. So, to start off, we'll just. If you guys are interested in my tour, I can just start off with the arrival points right here, down the escalator or the stairs. I don't know. Oh, it's an escalator. And we are now arriving to my own theme park, which I call Dinosaur Valley. Right there is the gift shop. There's the toy shop right there. Behind there is the or there is the five star level hotel. Pretty cool. Five star. They five star. And around these places is the market. The local marketplace. We got the, we got the fast food, the arcade, the the fossil zone, the the bar, the the clothes, the bowling alley, and uh, the restaurant. Right there. Uh, right. This here is the incubation center. I use this. I use this to sit. I just use this to uh, well, only incubate any dinosaur I want. That I ship them to their enclosures. Really spectacular. Spared no expense. Quote unquote for John Hammond himself. <laughs> really, he's a really good guy. Really good. So, if you guys are interested in a tour, I'd be happy to. Right here we, is the ranger station. There is the U AUC center, and right and behind them is the innovation and the security and science centers. Right there is the shelter, just in case. So, let's give it a drive, shall we? Sorry. Whoa, no skin. That's new. Ah, uh, well, he's out of duty. Nice and steady. Don't want to mimic him. So to start off, we'll just do Paddock 1. There is the. If you look at the your right, you'll see a herd of Carith Carithosaurus and a Bra and a trio of Brachiosaurus. Now I'm not sure if you guys have seen the Bra Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom, but the part about the Brachiosaur is very very sad. To my mother, it was very heartbreaking. I personally would want. If I was there, I would never allow that to happen at all. It, I mean, Brachiosaurs are pretty much the iconic symbol of Jurassic Park itself. And you know the plot. Well, the feeders need resupply, that can wait. Next is Paddock 2. These are the Ceratus, the Ceratopsians. Right there are the Cytoceratops. And there's the Triceratops. Both, both species are very different, but they're in the same family. The Ceratopsians, the horn, the horned-faced rep dinosaurs. They, of course, only one difference: the Cytoceratops was found in China, while the Triceratops is only found in t North America. Up there to your left, you will see a monorail station. Next stop on Paddock's, on Paddock's 3, well, is uh, this way. This is where the, the gyros, that's where the gyrosphere is. And here we have a, another trio of another family of sauropods, Mementisaurus. Now, these guys, these guys are from the second Jurassic Park movie. They, that's a, 
They have like the longest necks of all the sauropods in the of all the sauropods in the in the Jurassic Park movies. Now, um, uh, I I know it's I know the guys are here. They could there. We have Parasaurolophus. The cre the crested the long cre the crested hadrosaurus and a herd, small herd of Gallimimus. Basically, this in well, this enclosure is much the same as uh, well, the second Jurassic Park movie, where the hunt when the hunters were just um, when the hunters were just uh, chasing the after the dinosaurs. There was Parasaurolophus, the Gallimimus, and and the Mimichisaurus. There was also there were also the Pachycephalosaurus, but things got overcrowded, and I had to move them. One side, guys. One side. One side. I'm, I'm running a toy here. Move, move. He's got out of the way. These people are crawling. People are crawling like ants around here. Panic three. We have at panic three. We have Edmontosaurus. And right there is a Hawaii Hawaiianosaurus. And well. And beside them are the Chungkingosaurus, both Stegosaurus, well, found in Asia, perhaps in China or someplace. Now, while we're, ne while we're moving to the next paddock, I, I would like to say a few words if you don't mind. I, ever since I watched the Ever since I've seen the trailers of the games, move, 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 move. Ever since I saw the trailers of the game, I've been wanting this. I've been wanting this my whole life. I've been trying, simply wanting to get it. Right here is the pad is paddock uh, f f uh, uh, four, which I like, which I personally like to call the club and shield paddock. Right there, we have two. We simply have two uh, armored. Here we have armored plated dinosaurs, the Sauropelta. Or the. Oh no, 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 my mistake. That is the Polocanthus. <laughs> those two are. Those two are the Notosaur, the Sauropelta, that's the one. And there is the. There is the. Ankylosaurus. Yep. Yeah. yeah. These are all the, the armor plated dinosaurs. And here in Pad Paddock is the next paddock, you would There'd be another dinosaur, which is pretty hard to find. Now, where could it be? Well, I have to resupply this thing. Shh! I think I... Why I... Dilophosaurus. A very fast little guy. A rather fast guy. So yeah. I I came up with the I just came up with a friend 
I came up with the idea Dinosaur Valley after, well, I mean, a long, after a, just after a, a dream I had, Dinosaur Valley. And I, I used to do imagination. I was doing imagin imaginative adventures with a friend, with a friend of mine from school. Those were good times. All right, here we have the bone. We have the bone-headed dinosaurs, the pecky cephalosaurus right there. The four sti the stitchy monarchs. Pretty. C and we have another. And we have another now. Where is? Now we just have. There should be another. Oh, there it is, Draco Rex. This is an early form of of the dome-headed dinosaurs. Draco Rex has. You can. There's just two guesses on where you think those two, on what that name means. I could have sworn there'd be another, be another gate somewhere. So, there. In this here, in this here paddock, we should be, we have Baryonyx. An early, f a distant relative of the cro of the crocodilians. Baryonyx is opposed to is a is a long sided dinosaur simply re related to Spinosaurus. The only difference is that hey 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 you stay back you stay back hey 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 Where are your manners? Anyway, if you can look closely at the claws right there, it's supposed to have a bigger claw, just like it's like it does in the fossils, but this one doesn't. I don't know what the people are thinking about. Uh, power outage. One second, folks. This won't this won't take too long. Peter there. Alright. Uh, yeah, I know what you're thinking. I could have done that. I could have done something like this, like uh, a few moments ago, but I didn't. I, th I had to do it now because of the power outage. On the next paddock, there'll be there'll be another bread of dinosaur, also from also from the Fallen Kingdom, Carnotaurus. Now, if you guys have ever seen dinosaurs, like the Disney movie dinosaurs, and seen the Carnotaur, well, that movie is wrong. This is what a Carnotaurus is supposed to look like. Say, that's a normal-sized Carnotaurus. I don't know what the people are thinking about making a T-Rex-sized Carnotaur. <laughs> well, I guess that's because people today want something else than T-Rex to take the spotlight. The next paddock, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to isn't. I'm okay. Is the is another dino from the Jurassic era? Now there he is, Allosaurus, the Lion of the Jurassic. And I gotta say, nicely detailed. And just the same size as a normal T, as a normal Allosaurus. That's what I'm talking about. That's something that people have to do in life. They would have to make T, make dinosaurs in proper, with proper sizes and stuff. 
Our next stop is the second tarot sphere section. And here we have the We have two species, both from the Jurassic, the Apatosaurus and the Stegosaurus. People today are there. Stegosaurus. And if you ask me, these people are pretty pissy. I mean, oh, whoa, whoa. I mean, these, I mean, the Stegosaurus, they just, they just want four or five in their, in their herds. Because if they don't, then they, they get pissy and then they start attacking. One second, folks. The guy, this guy has a dead dino. Died of old age. Oh. On the side, and the side of the Ceratops died of old age too. Hey, where do you think you're going? Where do you think you're going? We're not done with the tour. Our next stop, ladies and gentlemen, would be as the next paddock, which I like to call the true and, I, well, the, the real king of the jungle. And there she is. Tyrannosaurus Rex. Smile, gorgeous. Yeah, that's just nothing. On East of Sorna, when I was doing that mission, I did, well, I did, I took a photograph of two Brachiosaurs and an Allosaurus put together, and <laughs> that gave me over $50,000. That's a very good deal. Very good. The ne our next stop is is, um, well, where is he? Where is he? There he is. The Spidosaurus. Yeah. He is from the third Jurassic Park movie. Now, that movie, if you ask me, that was the most terrible ever. I mean, come on. It was, the, di the, the new dinosaurs were okay. I don't mind uh, seeing a new dinosaur, but it was just terrible. I don't know why these people were thinking about it. I personally think that Steven Spielberg's first two Jurassic Park movies, those were the real bomb. The first one, the first Jurassic Park movie, that was a very memorial. That was all memorial. Jurassic Park 2. The Lost World, that one is actually my favorite. I'm not sure why, but it is. Ah, jeez, again. This, this won't take too long, folks. Almost done here, folks, and we shall be entering our next paddock. These are whoa, hey, where are you going? These are the Velociraptors. These are the Velociraptors. You can see them now. They are socializing. They are talking. Oh, nothing porny or uh, cursing or anything. <laughs> hey, well then. Let's see. Uh, that's, I think... That is pretty much it, ladies and gentlemen. That's the dinosaurs I would want you to see in this paddock. And I and I just hope you all enjoy it. Both, both. Oh. Ho. Here you are, folks. Have a good day in a tour. And 
Happy New Year.